Manuel Elcazón, known as the father of the national language, and the second president of the Philippines, was a great leader who dedicated his life to serving his countrymen. Today we will take a closer look at his remarkable life and legacy. Manuel Elcazón was born on August 19, 1878, in Baila, Tayabas, which is now Aurora Province. He grew up in a humble family and went on to study law at the University of Santo Tomás. He became a successful lawyer and entered politics in 1903, when he was elected as a member of the Philippine Commission. Kazon's political career was marked by his strong advocacy for Philippine independence. He fought for the rights of Filipinos and worked to establish a government that would serve the interests of the Filipino people. In 1935, he was elected as the second president of the Philippines, succeeding the American Governor General Frank Murphy. As president, Kazon worked tirelessly to improve the lives of Filipinos. He initiated social and economic reforms 